again and welcome back to J&J &J Destruction coming to you again with another model unboxing that I got today so without further ado we unbox I've already looked at it a little bit but I'll show you guys main body looks very nice I think I like it even though I'm not going to build this kit I still like it um, one of the main reasons I got this kit are the tires Mickey Thompson's. At least that's what it looks like to me. So, I'm very... I like those very much. I'm very happy with those. Um, chrome parts. Your wheels. Looks like Mickey Thompson wheels, too. Headlights and other grill stuff. Uh, it does come with working suspension. As you can see in the spring here. Let's put that over. But, like I said, I am not going to build this. So, if I do build it, it won't be like this. But, uh, your clear molded parts here. Windshield. I'm not going to take those out of the bag. I don't want to scratch them. There. Your white molded parts. Your big bag. Um, got your two axles here that, for some reason, are loose in the bag. Don't know why. But that's another main reason I got this kit. Your looks like your floor pan, your chassis, <coughs> dashboard, transfer case, which I may use on a different kit, I don't know. I'll tell you about that more later. And you got your main chassis. And this is a curbside kit, so you have your molded in engine on the bottom there. But I still think Paint it up nice, it could look good. Your front iconic Jeep grill, radiator, windshield wipers, those are nice. I'm missing a mirror right there. This is banged around a little bit in shipping, I guess. Let's see there. Uh, uh, interior here, panels look nicely detailed, better than some of the ones I've seen. Sidebars, your bumper. The bumper I may use on a different kit too. That looks really nice. Use that as a full bar and just silver on them. And there's my mirror. <laughs> uh, your seats. Average, I guess. One thing I might try to incorporate somehow in the silver I was those fender flares. They look nice and awesome. Your roll bar. That's about it for what's inside the kit. Um, we haven't looked at the instructions yet, but like I said, I'm not really going to build this kit. That's not really why I bought it. Which brings me to my point of why did I buy this set? I bought it for two things, really. I bought it for these and these. Why? Because the Dana 44 axles are going in the pulling truck along with the tires. And along with that, another announcement, I am taking the small block Chevy out of the 70 Chevelle and putting it in the 99 Silverado. So this is going to be a free kit bash going into that Silverado. It's going to be a 4x4. Four four. I'm going to make it, even though it's not from the kit, going to make it that. So hope you enjoy that. And once I get the projects finished that I'm doing now, I will start on the Silverado. And I'll make some videos on that. See you later.